An urban area or urban agglomeration is a human settlement with high population density and infrastructure of built environment. Urban areas are created through urbanization and are categorized by urban morphology as cities, towns, conurbations or suburbs. In urbanism, the term contrasts to rural areas such as villages and hamlets and in urban sociology or urban anthropology it contrasts with natural environment. The creation of early predecessors of urban areas during the urban revolution led to the creation of human civilization with modern urban planning, which along with other human activities such as exploitation of natural resources leads to human impact on the environment. The world's urban population in 1950 of just 746 million has increased to 3.9 billion in the decades since. In 2009, the number of people living in urban areas 3.42 billion surpassed the number living in rural areas 3.41 billion and since then the world has become more urban than rural. This was the first time that the majority of the world's population lived in a city. In 2014 there were 7.2 billion people living on the planet, of which the global urban population comprised 3.9 billion. The Population Division of the United Nations Department of Economic and Social Affairs at that time predicted the urban population would grow to 6.4 billion by 2050, with 37% of that growth to come from three countries China, India, and Nigeria. Urban areas are created and further developed by the process of urbanization. Urban areas are measured for various purposes, including analyzing population density and urban sprawl. Unlike an urban area, a metropolitan area includes not only the urban area, but also satellite cities plus intervening rural land that is socio-economically connected to the urban core city, typically by employment ties through commuting, with the urban core city being the primary labor market. <laughs> Definitions European countries define urbanized areas on the basis of urban type land use, not allowing any gaps of typically more than 200 meters (220 yards) and use satellite imagery instead of census blocks to determine the boundaries of the urban area. In less developed countries, in addition to land use and density requirements, a requirement that a large majority of the population, typically 75%, is not engaged in agriculture and or fishing is sometimes used. Argentina Argentina is highly urbanized. The ten largest metropolitan areas account for half of the population, and fewer than one in ten live in rural areas. About three million people live in Buenos Aires City and the Greater Buenos Aires Metropolitan Area totals around 15 million, making it one of the largest urban areas in the world, with a population of 18 million all up. Cordoba has around 1.5 million people living in the urban area, while Rosario, Mendoza and Tucumán have around 1.2 million inhabitants each and La Plata, Mar del Plata, Salta and Santa Fe have at least 500,000 people each. The population is unequally distributed amongst the provinces, about 60% live in the Pampa region 21% of the total area, including 20 million people in Buenos Aires Province, Córdoba Province Santa Fe Province and the autonomous city of Buenos Aires have 3 million each. Seven other provinces have over 1 million people each, Mendoza, Tucumán, Entrerís, Salta, Chaco, Corrientes and Misiones. Tucumán is the most densely populated with 60 per square kilometer, 160 per square miles, the only Argentine province more densely populated than the world average, while the southern province of Santa Cruz has around 1 inhabitant per square kilometer, 2.6 per square miles. Topic: <laughs> Australia In Australia, urban areas are referred to as urban centres, 
and are defined as population clusters of 1,000 or more people, with a density of at least 200 per square kilometres 518 per square miles Australia is one of the most urbanised countries in the world, with more than 50% of the population residing in the nation's five biggest cities. Brazil. According to IBGE, Brazilian Institute of Geography and Statistics, urban areas already concentrate 84.35% of the population, while the southeast region remains the most populated one with over 80 million inhabitants. The largest metropolitan areas in Brazil are São Paulo, Rio de Janeiro, and Belo Horizonte, all in the southeastern region, with 20, 12, and 5 million inhabitants respectively. The majority of state capitals are the largest cities in their states, except for Vitoria, the capital of Espírito Santo, and Florianópolis, the capital of Santa Catarina. There are also non-capital metropolitan areas in the states of São Paulo Campinas, Santos and the Paraíba Valley, Minas Gerais Steel Valley, Rio Grande do Sul Sinos Valley, and Santa Catarina Itagi Valley. Canada According to Statistics Canada, an urban area in Canada is an area with a population of at least 1,000 people where the density is no fewer than 400 persons per square kilometre if two or more urban areas are within 2 km miles of each other by road, they are merged into a single urban area, provided they do not cross census metropolitan area or census agglomeration boundaries. In the Canada 2011 census, Statistics Canada redesignated urban areas with the new term, "...population centre." The new term was chosen in order to better reflect the fact that urban versus rural is not a strict division, but rather a continuum within which several distinct settlement patterns may exist. For example, a community may fit a strictly statistical definition of an urban area, but may not be commonly thought of as «urban» because it has a smaller population, or functions socially and economically as a suburb of another urban area rather than as a self-contained urban entity, or is geographically remote from other urban communities. Accordingly, the new definition set out three distinct types of population centers, small population 1,000 to 29,999, medium population 30,000 to 99,999 and large population 100,000 or greater. Despite the change in terminology, however, the demographic definition of a population center remains unchanged from that of an urban area, a population of at least 1,000 people where the density is no fewer than 400 persons per square kilometer. China Since 2000, China's cities have expanded at an average rate of 10% annually. It is estimated that China's urban population will increase by 292 million people by 2050, when its cities will house a combined population of over 1 billion. The country's urbanization rate increased from 17.4% to 46.6% between 1978 and 2009. Between 150 and 200 million migrant workers work part-time in the major cities, returning home to the countryside periodically with their earnings. Today, China has more of cities with 1 million or more long-term residents than any other country, including the three global cities of Beijing, Hong Kong, and Shanghai. By 2025, the country will be home to 221 cities with over a million inhabitants. The figures in the table below are from the 2008 census, and are only estimates of the urban populations within administrative city limits. A different ranking exists when considering the total municipal populations, which includes suburban and rural populations. The large, floating populations of migrant workers make conducting censuses in urban areas difficult. The figures below include only long term residents.
Topic: Colombia. In Colombia the largest metropolitan area is Bogotá's, which has around 9.8 million of inhabitants and includes municipalities like Cota, La Calera, Chia, Soacha, Usacán, Suba, among others. It's one of the most important cities in Latin America, especially in business, art and culture. Bogotá has been the international city of the book and has unique places like Montserrat, Torre Colpatria, Bolivar Square, BD Bacatá, Corferius, National University etc. <laughs> Finland Similar to other Nordic countries, an urban area in, Finnish in Finland must have a building at least every 200 metres and at least 200 people. To be considered a town or a city for statistical purposes, an urban area must have at least 15,000 people. This is not to be confused with the city-town designation used by municipalities. Topic: France. In France, an urban area (FR) air urbain is a zone encompassing an area of built-up growth called an urban unit, unité urbaine, close in definition to the North American urban area and its commuter belt caron. Americans would find the INSEE definition of the urban area to be similar to their metropolitan area, and the INSEE sometimes uses the term air metropolitane to refer to the country's largest IRAs urbanes. The largest cities in France, in terms of urban area population 2013, are Paris 12,405,426, Lyon 2,237,676, Marseille 1,734,277, Toulouse 1,291,517, Bordeaux 1,178,335, Lille 1,175,828, Nice 1,472,000, Nantes 908,815, Strasbourg 773,447 and Rennes 700,675. Topic: Germany Germany has a number of large cities. There are 11 officially recognized metropolitan regions in Germany, and since 2006, 34 potential cities were identified which can be called a regiopolis. The largest conurbation is the Rhine-Ruhr region, 11 million in 2008, including Düsseldorf, the capital of North Rhine-Westphalia, Cologne, Bonn, Dortmund, Essen, Duisburg, and Bochum. India For the census of India 2011, the definition of urban area is a place having a minimum population of 5,000 of density 400 persons per square kilometre or higher, and 75% plus of the male working population employed in non-agricultural activities. Places administered by a municipal corporation, cantonment board, or notified town area committee are automatically considered urban areas. The Census of India 2011 also defined the term urban agglomeration as an integrated urban area consisting of a core town together with its outgrowths, contiguous suburbs. Topic: <laughs> Japan. In Japan urbanized areas are defined as contiguous areas of densely inhabited districts DIDs using census enumeration districts as units with a density requirement of 4000 inhabitants per square kilometer 10000 per square miles Topic <inaudible> <inaudible> Netherlands 
The Netherlands is the 30th most densely populated country in the world, with 404.6 inhabitants per square kilometer, 1048 per square miles, or 497 inhabitants per square kilometer, 1287 per square miles, if only the land area is counted. The Randstad is the country's largest conurbation located in the west of the country and contains the four largest cities, Amsterdam, Rotterdam, The Hague, and Utrecht. The Randstad has a population of 7 million inhabitants and is the sixth largest metropolitan area in Europe. <laughs> New Zealand Statistics New Zealand defines urban areas in New Zealand, which are independent of any administrative subdivisions and have no legal basis. There are three classes of urban area, main urban areas are the 17 urban areas which have a population of 30,000 or more, secondary urban areas are the 14 urban areas which have a population of 10,000 or more but less than 30,000, and minor urban areas are the 103 urban areas which have a population of 1,000 or more but less than 10,000. Urban areas are reclassified after each New Zealand census, so population changes between censuses does not change an urban area's classification. For example, Rolston Pop. is still classified as a minor urban area because its population was under 10,000 at the 2013 census. Norway. Statistics Norway defines urban areas similarly to the other Nordic countries. Unlike in Denmark and Sweden, the distance between each building has to be of less than 50 metres, although exceptions are made due to parks, industrial areas, rivers, and similar. Groups of houses less than 400 metres from the main body of an urban area are included in the urban area. Topic: Pakistan. In Pakistan, an area is a major city and municipality if it has more than 100,000 inhabitants, according to census results. Cities include adjacent cantonments. Urbanization in Pakistan has increased since the time of independence and has several different causes. The majority of southern Pakistan's population lives along the Indus River. Karachi is its most populous city. In the northern half of the country, most of the population lives in an arc formed by the cities of Lahore, Faisalabad, Rawalpindi, Islamabad, Gujranwala, Sialkot, Gujrat, Jhelum, Sargodar, Sheikhupura, Naushera, Mardan and Peshawar. During 1990–2008, city dwellers made up 36% of Pakistan's population, making it the most urbanized nation in South Asia. Furthermore, 50% of Pakistanis live in towns of 5,000 people or more. Karachi is the most populated city in Pakistan closely followed by Lahore according to the 2017 census. Topic: Philippines. With an estimated population of 16.3 million, Metro Manila is the most populous metropolitan area in the Philippines and the 11th in the world. However, the greater urban area is the fifth largest in the world with a population of 20,654,307 people, 2010 estimate. Including Metro Manila, the Philippines has 12 metropolitan areas as defined by the National Economic and Development Authority Metro Angeles, Metro Bacolod, Metro Baguio, Metro Batangas, Metro Cagayan de Oro, Metro Cebu, Metro Dagupan, Metro Davao, Metro Iloilo Guimaras, Metro Naga, Metro Olingapo. As per Republic Act No. 9009, in order to become a city, a local government unit must 
locally generated income of at least 100 million pesos based on constant prices in the year 2000 for the last two consecutive years, as certified by the Department of Finance, and a population of 150,000 or more, as certified by the National Statistics Office NSO, OR a contiguous territory of 100 square kilometers, as certified by the Land Management Bureau, with contiguity not being a requisite for areas that are on two or more islands. Poland In Poland, official, urban, population figures simply refer to those localities which have the status of towns miasta". The «rural» population is that of all areas outside the boundaries of these towns. This distinction may give a misleading impression in some cases, since some localities with only village status may have acquired larger and denser populations than many many smaller towns. Topic Russia Topic Singapore Singapore is an island city state in Southeast Asia. About 5.6 million people live and work within 700 square kilometers, 270 square miles, making Singapore the second most densely populated country in the world after Monaco, another city-state. The central area in the southeastern part of the island is the country's city center. It is surrounded by suburban settlements outside of its limits. These settlements are connected to the central area and each other by a dense network of roads, expressways and metro railway lines dubbed MRT by locals. Singapore has a highly centralized, unitary government with a unicameral legislature the city council and the rural board were abolished in the 1960s. While there are town councils and mayors in Singapore, these are essentially property managers in charge of the maintenance of public housing within their constituency boundaries. They do not represent local authorities with any legislative or executive autonomy from the national government. <laughs> South Africa Topic: South Korea. The largest cities of South Korea have an autonomous status equivalent to that of provinces. Seoul, the largest city and capital, is classified as a Tokbyilzi special city, while the next six largest cities, see the list below, are classified as Gwangyuksi metropolitan cities. See special cities of South Korea. Smaller cities are classified as C cities and are under provincial jurisdiction at the same level as counties C administrative divisions of South Korea. Topic: <inaudible> Sweden. Urban areas in Sweden are statistically defined localities, totally independent of the administrative subdivision of the country. There are 1,956 such localities in Sweden, with a population ranging from 200 to 1,372,000 inhabitants. Taiwan. The figures below are the 2011 estimates for the 20 largest urban populations within administrative city limits. A different ranking exists when considering the total metropolitan area populations. In such rankings, the Taipei Keelung metro area is by far the largest agglomeration. Topic: <laughs> United Kingdom The United Kingdom's Office for National Statistics has produced census results from urban areas since 1951. Since 1981, based upon the extent of irreversible urban development indicated on Ordnance Survey maps, 
The definition is an extent of at least 20 hectares and at least 1,500 census residents. Separate areas are linked if less than 200 meters (220 yards) apart. Included are transportation features. The UK has five urban areas with a population over a million and a further 69 with a population over 100,000. Topic: <laughs> United States. In the United States, there are two categories of urban area. The term urbanized area denotes an urban area of 50,000 or more people. Urban areas under 50,000 people are called urban clusters. Urbanized areas were first delineated in the United States in the 1950 census, while urban clusters were added in the 2000 census. There are 1,371 urban areas and urban clusters with more than 10,000 people. The U.S. Census Bureau defines an urban area as, "...core census block groups or blocks that have a population density of at least 1,000 people per square mile and surrounding census blocks that have an overall density of at least 500 people per square mile The largest urban area in the United States is the New York metropolitan area. The population of New York City, the core of the metropolitan area, exceeds 8.5 million people. Its metropolitan statistical area has a population that is over 20 million, and its combined statistical area population is over 23 million. The next six largest urban areas in the U.S. are Los Angeles, Chicago, Miami, Philadelphia, San Francisco, Houston, and Atlanta. About 82% of the population of the United States lives within the boundaries of an urbanized area as of December, 2010. Combined, these areas occupy about 2% of the land area of the United States. Many Americans live in agglomerations of cities, suburbs, and towns that are adjacent to a metropolitan area's largest city. The concept of urbanized areas as defined by the U.S. Census Bureau is often used as a more accurate gauge of the size of a city, since in different cities and states the lines between city borders and the urbanized area of that city are often not the same. For example, the city of Greenville, South Carolina has a city population just over 64,000 and an urbanized area population of over 800,000, while Greensboro, North Carolina has a city population just over 285,000 and an urbanized area population of around 400,000, meaning that Greenville is actually larger for some intents and purposes, but not for others, such as taxation, local elections, etc. In the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Natural Resources Inventory, urban areas are officially known as developed areas or urban and built-up areas. Such areas include cities, ethnic villages, other built-up areas of more than 10 AC 4 hectares, industrial sites, railroad yards, cemeteries, airports, golf courses, shooting ranges, institutional and public administration sites, and similar areas. The 1997 National Resources Inventory placed over 98 million AC 40 million hectares in this category, an increase of 25 million AC 10 million hectares since 1982. <inaudible> Vietnam In Vietnam, there are six types of urban areas, Special urban area, two municipalities, Hanoi and Ho Chi Minh City. Type 1 urban area, 12 provincial cities and three municipalities, Than Hoa, Ha Long, Viet Tri, Ho Nguyen, Nam Dinh, Vung Tau, Buon Ma Thuot, Da Lat, Quai Non, Nha Trang, Hue, Vinh, Can Tho, Da Nang and Hai Phong. 
Type 2 urban area, 21 provincial cities and one district: Dong Hoi, Ung Bi, Bak Jang, Bak Nin, Nin Bin, Bak Liu, Ba Ria, Ho Bin, Rach Zha, California Mao, Long Xuan, Mai Tho, Fan Rang, Tarp Cam, Tui Hoa, Fan Thiet, Pli Ku, Tu Dai Mo, Bian Hoa, Hai Duang, Vin Yen, Lao Kai, and Fu Kwok. Type 3 urban area, 31 provincial cities and 12 towns. Type 4 urban area 35 towns and 35 townships Type 5 urban area 586 townships and 54 communes Topic See also equals 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 lists